Welcome back everyone. I've seen that a few of you actually want me to play free for all uh, more than teams. So here we go with the free for all game. This doesn't mean I'm not gonna play free for all anymore. Sorry, games anymore, uh, teams anymore. But let's give free for all some attention as well. I've played a couple of games and uh, haven't shown you yet. Uh, I gained some rating points as well, so. Uh, I'm trying to get over 1900, that would be a cool achievement. And let's get back into a free for all mentality. Okay. This is already an anno annoying move because he's. Um, he doesn't allow me to push without having the risk of exchanging bishops. So that could be dangerous. It looks like red takes his time every move and this is something you have to notice because you might be able to use it in the future. I'm gonna develop the other knight, not committing this pawn just yet and this happened a few times to me where I can push now and yellow doesn't notice and I can take the bishop and rook. Now, it's very hard that it's gonna happen in this game but let's give it a try. Plus, if it does exchange, it's good because it look, I can show everyone else that I'm fine with exchanges, so they have to be careful about me. Uh, Alright, I, I talked a lot about here exchanges. Um, it's alright. I'm gonna take with the king, play king up, then bring the rook to this side and castle manually all the way. It looks like green and red are pushing towards the center. Uh, hopefully they're gonna stop each other. Wow. So yellow is going for my king, clearly. And what should I play? This is interesting because if he does take, then I can take with this one opening my rook and that would be nice. But if I want to castle manually, then my rook is not gonna be on this file anyway. So should I take with this pawn instead if he does? And what should I play next? Should I play here? Hmm. And now actually green can promote because red is, can't really stop him, so... Hmm. It's quickly becoming very interesting and I'm gonna play here anyways. I will have to be extremely careful about... Uh... <laughs> checks on uh, uh, this diagonal and... Actually, I noticed just after I played that I made a huge mistake here. Um, because my knight is pinned. Uh, it's not a huge mistake. It's uh, it's totally fine. My king is weak though. So, it can be dangerous. Uh, let's see how it goes. Maybe I will have to show you some tactics uh, on how to play when you're down position and material. It can be interesting, so I'm not too desperate about the situation. It's fine. Okay, he had to play knight out because uh, green was targeting the rook. And he also developed a piece, so it's good for him. Um, I definitely need another um, minor piece defending here. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to play pawn up. And after that, I'm going to play Knight. Well, I can't play knight here because there is too much pressure from the queens. So I need to find another way to get my knight to this side. I would love to have a knight over here. Okay, actually, I could play here now and then here. The only problem is that he, he can come down here with the queen and exchange queens because my knight is not defending that square anymore. So let me play here first. Then I will play here. With the bishop, but now it's dangerous because this guy could exchange bishops again. So yellow could be very annoying for me in this game. Very annoying. Wow, bishop out and bishop back. He's attacking the queen once again. So I don't want to play here because yellow could take. Then green could take. 
So I need to find something else. But I don't have much, so I will play here and then castle manually now. So if yellow does take my bishop, then it's bad for both of us, so I hope yellow is not going to do so. He pushes there. The only problem with that move is that it weakens a lot this night. What? Why did he resign? Be because okay, it was free, and then if he took, I mean, if he took with the queen, or if he didn't take with the queen, he would have lost hours also. Well, that is why. But now I can play here, and I will play here. Oh, oh, yellow, you're giving the win to. Uh, they're giving the win to yeah, uh, Green because Green is gonna take the the king here, and if he does, he, he should have taken down here definitely, definitely. Well, I can take my rook as well now, but wow, what a disaster! Oh wait, 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 wait. So let me take a queen just for fun. If he takes with the king, I'm gonna play here or here. Takes with the knight. I think I'm gonna play here because I do have a chance to exchange bishops without losing the bishop for free. But this doesn't look good at all. This doesn't look good at all. Oh, this does look good though. Nice, I like that a lot. I'm gonna play here now. So yellow has to defend. I'm gonna go back here and hopefully be able to take the king. That would be amazing. For sure I don't deserve this win if I do, but... Okay, let's go back here. Or uh, Maybe even taking here is fine, but then I don't want to lose the knight. And that would be only one pawn because then you can defend with the knight in the middle, for example. Um, next, uh, next, I'm gonna play knight here. If he takes over here, I take you over here. Twenty points more, and hopefully be able to get at least second place. This is my plan. But this was a very weird game. It never happened to me a game like this one. Okay, this looks even better. He's allowing the rook, and I'm giving a check over here. Can I take the king? That would be amazing. That basically gifted me the win because green was won. I mean, won already by move 15. And now it looks like yellow can promote, but he's way behind in points. Green could take over here and have some pressure, and that would be nice. Uh, green could check over here. He could check over here, and that would be painful. That would be very annoying. Save. Okay, let's take over here. This is amazing. This is amazing. Actually, if one of the two resigns, then I can resign as well and win. That would be fantastic. Okay, it gives me a check. It's a bit too late though now. And he's like attacking the bishop as well. Is he gonna play? No, he can't even attack me, so. What can I play though? Oh, I like that. I really like that. I'm gonna play here. If he does take over here, I'm gonna play king here. If he checks, I can go here. That's why. Or maybe I can actually play queen up here so that maybe I can have some checkmating chances. Oh, that would be fantastic. Okay, moves away. But think, oh no, 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 I could be able to take the, uh, something from yellow, but can I? Well, I could play this, but no, I will lose the knight. Or I could play just this, with the idea that I could, maybe, come in with my queen. Okay, it goes here. Check. <gasps> 
almost, almost. Ah, oh, because he wants to take. Is there mate? Come on. If there is mate, then it's fantastic. There isn't. There isn't. So I will play here instead. I will play here instead. Let's see. I mean, this is inc an incredible game. I've seen someone in the comments say, <laughs> 3 for all is not random, but <laughs> this is pretty random in my eyes. This is completely madness. Is there maid? No, there isn't maid yet. So what I can just do is take pieces from... Uh, nope. Uh, uh, <gasps> this is maid? No, it's not made. You can play queen in the middle. Oh, I'll go here. I couldn't really see a, a clean way to actually take the queen. Maybe I could have just played here. But there was the risk that he would play queen in the middle. So now he's gonna play this for sure. Green can't check again. I'm gonna retreat all the way with the bishop. I think he wants to check over here with the queen. But if he does, I don't have mate yet again. There must have been a mate somehow, somewhere, but I can't see. Tommy checks again. Yes, it does again. So I would play here now, because this would mean that I can take the queen as well. Hope Yellow is not going to resign though. Yellow, don't resign. <gasps> no, he moves the king and it's check. Oh, I didn't notice that. I didn't notice that. <sighs> Wait, getting to move? Oh yeah, wait, green to move, he could take my king. What? What is going on? He could take my king. How does it work? Can he just take my king and I lose? No, he doesn't take my king. So, no. Well, I could have played here mate if he was in check. Wow. Well, now I will play this. Or this. Not this. Uh, hopefully it gives another check, but it's hard to give a check now. He has to take over here, but he's not going to take over there. So unfortunately I made a mistake, but I could have come back entirely from this. Yeah, yellow can take my queen. He didn't take my queen? What is going on in this game? What is going on in this game? Oh my god, this is incredible. No! Why, why Why? was I going to play that? I could play this, but then he takes my queen and I don't win. I'll play here instead. Um, Oh, that was a good move, huh? That's a good move for him. But maybe not. <gasps> Is this mate? Oh my god. Oh, I can't believe this. I can't. I cannot believe this. Oh my god. How did I win this game? How did I win this game? How? How? Tell me how. Tell me how. So I'm sorry because the game wasn't the most perfect game ever. But... <laughs> I cannot not show you how lucky I've been in this game. I cannot. So, I really enjoyed playing this game. I, uh, I made a lot of mistakes. I hope you enjoyed watching though.
See you in the next one.